standard first subject maths hello student i am jyoti singh today we will learn a new topic but before i start my topic i would like to ask you some question student when we go in a shop to buy something what does the shopkeeper ask for yes money so student today we will learn a new topic coins and currency notes we can buy things which we need in day to day life by paying money money is divided in coins and currency notes in india Indian currency is in the form of paise and rupee. Paise is donated with P and rupee is donated with this symbol. Student, look at these coins. Have you ever seen these coins? Okay. So these coins are used in our India. First coin 50 paise. One rupee, two rupees, five rupees, ten rupees. These are the coins in India we use. Now notes in India. One rupee, five rupees, ten rupees, twenty rupees. Fifty rupees, one hundred rupees, two hundred rupees, five hundred rupees, two thousand rupees. Now, student, here make the given amount using different combinations of coins. So here we have one rupee. So, coin of one rupee of one makes one rupee. Coin of one rupees of two makes two rupees. Coin of two rupees and one rupees makes three rupees. Coin of Two rupees of three makes six rupees. Coin of five rupees of two makes ten rupees. Coin of ten rupees, five rupees, and coin of two rupees makes seventeen rupees. Coin of ten rupees of two makes twenty rupees. Now, student, here we have some things. Which notes or coins will you pay to buy given things? So here the cost of the things is given. So the cost of the notebook is rupees fifty, and the cost of the eraser is rupees. Three and the cost of the bottle is rupees twenty. So now, which notes or coins will we have to pay? We will see that. Now, student, look here. Take the coins which you pay to buy given things. So here, given things is notebook, and the cost of the notebook is rupees fifteen. So which coins you pay to make rupees fifteen? Yes, ten rupees coin and five rupees coin. Now here the cost of eraser is rupees three. So which coin you will pay to make rupees three? Yes, one rupee and two rupees. 
Now, next, the cost of the water bottle is rupees 20. So, which coin will you pay to make rupees 20? Yes. 5 rupees coin, 5 rupees coin and 10 rupees coin. Now, student, we are given things are pencil, crayons, box and kite. So, the amount is also given. The cost of the pencil is rupees 5 and the cost of the crayon box is rupees 10 and the cost of the rupees of kite 6. Take the coins which you pay to buy given things. So, here given things is pencil. The cost of the pencil is rupees 5. So, which coin you will you may pay to make rupees 5? Yes, single 5 rupees coin. Now here, the cost of the crayons is rupees 10. So, which coin you will pay to make rupees 10? Yes, coin of 5 rupees and coin of 5 rupees. So, it means 2 coins of 5 rupees. Now, the cost of the kite is rupees 6. So, which coin will you pay to make rupees 6? Yes, 1 rupee and 5 rupees of coin. Now, student, look at this picture. What do you understand by looking this picture? Yes, the boy is returning home from school with his mother. On the way, he saw a balloon seller. So, he asked her mother, I want that balloon. So, her mother went to the balloon seller and asked the cost of the balloon. So, the balloon seller said, the cost of one balloon is rupees 12. So, let's see how many coin and note her mother paid to give rupees 12. Cost of balloon rupees 12. So, his mother paid 5 rupees coin plus 5 rupees coin plus 2 rupees coin is equal to rupees 12. So, 5 rupees plus 5 rupees plus 2 rupees is equal to rupees 12. One sharpener cost 3 rupees. So, how much will 2 sharpener cost? Let's check. See, again I am reading the question. One sharpener cost 3 rupees. So, now we have to find 2 sharpeners cost. So, here I have two sharpener. The cost of one sharpener is rupees 3. Plus, the cost of one more sharpener is rupees 3. So, 3 rupees plus 3 rupees is equal to rupees 6. Rita bought a ice cream by giving one currency note of 10 rupees and 1 coin of rupees 5. What is the cost of the ice cream? Let's check. So, Rita paid 10 rupees note plus 5 rupees coin is equal to rupees 50. So, the cost of the ice cream is rupees 50. Karan bought a pen of 15 rupees and a chocolate of 5 rupees. How many rupees did he pay for that? So student, Karan bought a pen of rupees 50 and chocolate of 5 rupees. Now we have to find how much amount he paid for it. So Karan paid cost of chocolate. Plus cost of pen rupees 15 
plus rupees 5 is equal to rupees 20. Now student, now activity time. Stick the picture of different amount of coins and currency of India in your notebook. Now it's your homework time. Find the price of the things by counting coins. So here the coins is given. You have to count the number of coins and you have to find out the price of the things. Match the following. Thank you.